Laminated veneer lumber, or LVL, is a mass timber product that is made by bonding thin wood veneers together in parallel to form large billets, which can later easily be cut into smaller LVL elements. The real development of laminated veneer lumber began in the 1970s, during the search for more reliable and efficient building materials. Initially developed in the United States, laminated veneer lumber has become a popular choice worldwide and is the most commonly used variant of the structural composite lumber category. Now let's take a look at the manufacturing process of LVL. The manufacturing process of LVL involves several very specific steps to ensure the high quality and reliability of the final products. The first step is the debarking and then conditioning of the logs. The logs are then rotary cut into thin veneers that are typically around 3 mm thick. After this, the veneers are scanned by cameras to detect any defects. Extreme defects like knots or splits are removed and allowable defects are dispersed throughout the veneers. The veneers are then analyzed for their moisture content and then dried to a moisture content of around 8 to 10 percent. The veneers are coated in a waterproof phenol formaldehyde resin adhesive aligned so that the grains of the veneers run in parallel and then laminated together under a lot of heat and pressure to form large LVL billets. These LVL billets can then be cut into any required size for various applications. Laminated veneer lumber is available in a range of sizes to suit various construction needs. The maximum panel size is 24.4 meters long, 2.4 meters wide and 75 millimeters thick. More common lengths are 20.1, 18.3, 17 and 14.6 meters. As for the beams, commonly used depths are 606, 476, 406, 302 and 241 millimeters. LVL is very versatile and can be used for various structural applications, including columns and beams, lintels and scaffold boards and wood eye joists. It is optimal for areas where the appearance of the elements isn't the primary concern. As for the handling and treatment of the LVL elements, they can very easily be cut, nailed, screwed or drilled using regular tools. It can also be treated during manufacturing by impregnating the veneers or treating the final product surface. For in-ground applications, LVL should be treated with preservatives to protect against decay and infestation. It is essential to store the LVL elements flat, off the ground and dry to prevent decay. The fire performance of LVL members is very similar to that of glue lamp members of similar sizes. It is less prone to shrinking, warping or splitting than natural timber, making it a very reliable choice for structural applications. LVL is typically shipped out in large billets, which can later be cut and customized for specific project requirements. It is usually transported on flatback trucks, protected with a tarp or covering to shield it from moisture and environmental elements. Due to its size and weight, LVL requires very careful handling during transportation to prevent damage. One of the key benefits of LVL products is its incredible sustainability. LVL can be made from smaller diameter trees, which are often sourced from sustainably managed forests. The manufacturing process makes very efficient use of the wood, minimizing waste and using nearly every part of the log. If you want to learn more about the different types of mass timber, follow the links in the description. And if you want to learn more about the world of mass timber as a whole, subscribe to this channel. Stay informed, stay inspired, Timber Talk.